Yes guys and welcome back to another formation video on the channel today. I'm going to be telling you about the 5-2-2-1 formation on FIFA 21 with custom tactics and player instructions post patch. Of course, these are going to be pro player tactics, so make sure you subscribe if you do find this video useful. So the 5-2-2-1 is a very very unknown formation in FIFA 21, which is why I really like it. A lot of pros use this formation, it's very very good, it's very unpredictable, so if your opponent comes up against you, they are going to be very, very surprised because this formation is so, so unique. So let's get into the tactics now, 45-2-2-1. So our defensive style is going to be left on balance and our width and depth are going to be on 5 and 6. You want your wing backs to push wide, you want them to cover or pocket their wingers. To do this, we want to have our attacking whip on 5 and 6. Personally, I use 5 though, so they stay in their positions. Our depth is going to be on 6 because the formation itself is quite attacking your left wing backs and your right wing backs can get up the pitch, that's what they're made for. Your centre can also push up the pitch. Left wingers, right winger, striker are there to stay full guys. So, the formation itself is pretty attacking, so we want to match that with our attack or our defensive depth. With our attacking style, we are going to balance. You can play any offensive style with this formation, no matter what. Possession, fast build up, long ball, everything works because you're narrow and you're wide. You've got a diamond shape um, formation in that middle with your two centre mids, your striker and your centre back. So four narrow players there. You've got your wingers and your left wing backs and right wing backs. So the formation itself suits any offensive style. With our offensive width, we are going to be on five. Again, this is perfect. Your players will stay in their positions. They won't go any wider. They won't go any narrower. For our players in the box, guys, we are going to be on four. This is because... If we are 5, treat it as if every single section you go up on the players in the box is a player because you've got 10 outfield players and you've got 10 options there. So, if we have 4, we are able to get our striker, our wingers and one of our sentiments in that box. If not, your striker, your 2 sentiments and one winger in that box. This is why it's so, so good because one of them players there is going to be in crossing in the ball. So, we can't have all of them in the box. And if we went to 5, then one of our wing backs is going to push forward. So 4 is perfect because if our left winger is crossing in the ball, we've got our other 4 players, our striker, our right winger, and our 2 centre mids to get in the box. Same for the right winger. If our centre mid is putting your ball into that box, we've got our 2 wingers, our striker, and our centre mid in that box. So it works very, very nicely, and that's what I recommend. Corners and 3 kicks, 2 and 2. So that is going to be the tactics for the 5 2 2 1. Now let's head into the instructions. So our strikers or our wingers are going to stay forward and that will be it. This is because no need to get back. You've got the exact same players, just defenders, with your left wing backs and right wing backs. So there's no need for them to get back. So we leave them on stay forward and default everything so they're unpredictable. They cut inside, they get in behind, they take long shots, it's perfect. Striker, stay central, stay forward and get in behind. Again, this is very, very good because if our player or our winger are, set, are basically crossing in that ball, our striker is going to be running in behind, darting in behind to get on the end of that cross, guys. Two seconds, let me do this. With our centre mids, guys, we are going to uncover centre. This is because they can get up and down that pitch, help out of the attack and defence. Centre has D for everything and wing backs balance everything, guys, getting up and down that pitch. Whipping in a ball, getting back, helping out the defence and the attack, guys. If our wing backs push forward, like I said, our sentiments aren't getting forward all the time. They can cover for them. Goalkeeper comes across his and super keeper, guys, and that will be it. So, guys, that is the instructions for the 5 formation. Please make sure to like and subscribe if you did find this video useful as it really helps the channel grow. Anyway, guys, have a great short day, have a great week, and goodbye.